Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for January 29th and 30th for Pisces. Hi, Pisces. Oh, cards already want to jump for you. Okay, as always, I'm using my Doreen Virtue Angel Tarot cards. I have prayed, meditated, and infused with Reiki energy. And this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate with you. Take what you like, leave the rest. Now, Pisces... Those planets are still going direct, and they're still pushing you forward. But I don't think that they're being that harsh on you. But let's see what the cards have to say with that. But I think that it's a gentle movement. You do like to stay where you're at. You do like to visit the past a lot of times. And sometimes you stay in that past, which is not necessarily the healthiest thing for you. So what's happening is that this, this planet energy, I am feeling that it is gently pushing you it's not doing the big push you know but it's gently pushing you and every time you want to go back it's going no 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 just keep going forward okay so um and you're okay with that you're like okay okay i'll go forward you know because this is divine energy this is energy that's beyond us so you know and i think that you actually connect into this energy better than you ever do okay so first card is reversed and this one is the two of water, which is your energy. And this one is a relationship that continues to grow closer. Forgiveness, the positive resolution of a, con of a conflict. Ugh. Okay. So again, it's like, again, it's like you're going forward. And I actually feel that for a lot of Pisces, I'm feeling that there's, that there's a, a spiritual development coming that or that is occurring i don't think that it's a one that's like pulling you i don't think it's quite as harsh but i think this might be your time pisces to start you know developing you know being more and the word esoteric is um coming to me it, it, it's like you're looking for answers more so that's not in the physical realm so you're looking more into the spiritual realm so let's see what else is going on here too this one is also reversed and this one is Renewal, Archangel Jeremiel. And again, so if you look, you know, there is a blessing. There is Archangel Blessings. Review and evaluate a favorable assessment of the facts. Time to move in a new direction. So that's pretty much what I am feeling for these two days, that you're looking at things and thinking things like, you know, you know, this, it, it's, it's, I'm feeling that you're thinking things like, you know, this isn't the way it's supposed to be. And I'm not talking about your situation. I'm thinking you're thinking even, you know, bigger than that. Okay. You're thinking, you're thinking bigger and you're like, this isn't the way the world is supposed to be. This isn't what the universe is supposed to be. You know, there's, so, it's supposed to be this and it's supposed to be better. Now, not to say that, you know, cause there, there's conflicts in the universe. Okay. There are conflicts. So it's not all you know, unicorns and rainbows in the universe. But there is, you know, there's the positive and there's the negative. There's the light and there's the dark. And it's kind of like you're, you're, you know, you're kind of coming to another realization that you need to go more to that positive and to that light. Because without being, without that positive and light, it, you know, the dark, the dark and the negative will get bigger. Okay. And it's like, you know, don't know why I'm going down this path with you, um, Pisces, but I feel that some of you are feeling this way. And, you know, and that's actually why I'm doing what I'm doing is to possibly hold, put, you know, not, it's possibly for people to become more aware of that light and that positive, because if we don't, then that dark and negative gets, gets stronger, okay? And things may be, things will get out of balance. And if they're going to get out of balance, we really don't want it to be towards the dark or the negative. I'd rather it be positive in life. Okay, this last card here is Ego, Archangel Jephiel. And this one is a false sense of entrapment, being overly focused on material things and negative or fear-based thoughts. So yes, there's always that with that. So being, you know, it, 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 it's very hard to go through or to start a spiritual journey because, you know, you, know, you have to come back to a point that says, well, I still have to live on this earth. I still have to do this. You know, so how am I supposed to get through this? It's very, very hard. It's hard. So these are some of the these are some of the thought processes that you're going to be having. You know, it's hard, but yet you're still going to be pulled towards that. You're still being pulled. And you have decisions. You can make you can make choices. You can say, I don't want to go there. 
you know I mean I've had that in my own life that says you know it's, it's too overwhelming but then the thing is that um, you know it, it, it's then if this is your leaning then they you know it comes back to you so maybe it's better to get your, your training in now so that you can get to where you need to be okay these are going to be interesting days. I'm wondering now, um, you know, if these are going to go forward more so for you or if this is going to be something that you choose to say, yeah, let's stop it right here. I don't think so. I think Pisces that you're intrigued. Okay. 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 Again, too, if you haven't subscribed, go below. And Pisces, as always, know that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.